coaches here in preparation for Friday's game against Central Crossing. I'm here on my left here. I got Coach Allman, Coach Parbizo, and over and the best of all, Coach Waits, the head coach. Yes, sir, bud. So, you three, um, how, how did practice go today for all of you? It was awesome. First of all, we started in the weight room, Fuzz. We had a great weight room session, and we had a great practice today, offensively, defensively, and special teams. So it was a great practice today. Barbiza, what did you think of your guys? Yeah, defense is playing well. You know, when they're, they're flying around, still need to clean some things up, but uh, we'll get there by Friday. What about you, Coach? Uh, receivers had a great day to practice. Got a lot of work in early on individual uh, offense, so we're ready to go. All righty. So, I know you guys have been around the program. Um, so kind of tell me, what does this rivalry mean to each of you? Well, to, to me, Fuzz, I told our kids this every single day. Yeah, yeah it's a rival game because it's right here in Grove City and, you know, right here in the central area. But every game's a big game for Grove City. Every game is big for us. That's what I tell our kids every day. It's not just Central Crossing. It's not anybody else on our schedule. And whoever we're playing that week is our rival. It's our big game. So this is a big game for us because it's the one we're playing. That, that's how we're that's how we're approaching this week. Coach Forbes, similar to Coach Waits, you know anybody that anytime you play someone that's in your same town, that's a lot of fun, and there'll be a lot of people there. But look at our schedule. Like Coach said, it's an all OCC schedule, so every week is a big week because all OC teams, all OCC teams have talent. They're all well coached, so you gotta be ready to go. Yeah, we're looking to get to three and one. It doesn't really matter who it is, but being across town, we're excited about that opportunity, though. And for this game, not only for your guys, but also for the students here, um, this is a game that everybody has their eyes on. It's probably one of the biggest, if not the biggest, athletic event of the entire year. So, in your eyes, um, how have you been kind of motivating your guys into this rivalry that is different from your other games? Fuzz, like I said before, this is no different than any other week for us. We are, we are going to motivate our guys, no matter who we're playing, to be their absolute best in the weight room every day and absolute best in the practice every day. And if we do those things, good things are going to happen for us. It doesn't matter who we're playing, okay? This, this yes, it is a cool thing. It's, it's a gross city thing. But you know what? We motivate our kids the same way every week. We're not changing for anybody. This this happens to be Central Cross, and this is a game we're motivating our kids. And if you guys want to add, uh, absolutely. Same goes here. No, we're good. All righty. So, and then at this standpoint, um, I kind of want to go a little bit backward into Thomas Worthington a little bit. Obviously, huge win. Um, Grove said he got started early on the 21-0 run. Um, offense looked fantastic out there. Um, kind of tell, and then defense kind of got into a rhythm as well. Um, kind of tell me um, with that game in mind, Grove City is going to two and one now. Um, tell me, um, what was your biggest takeaways from the game? Well, you know, first of all, Fuzz, Jay Howard, our offensive line coach, does a great job preparing our kids every single week. Okay, our offensive linemen are always prepared. Remember, we were playing Coach Allman. Coach Hunter Joseph, prepare our receivers every day. Coach Schoonover, you know, prepares our running backs every single week. So those guys, hats off to those guys. They did a great job preparing us for Thomas Worthington last week and we were ready to roll at the very beginning. And we had a quick start. Absolutely, and with that in mind, Grove City got off to a big win. Um, Coach Farbs, do you, do you want to add anything about your defense? Uh, defense played well too. You know, we've changed everything on offense, everything on defense. The kids are really buying buying into it. They're playing really hard. Um, you know, yeah, in the second half, we made a few mistakes. That's going to happen, okay? But the kids are really playing hard. And, uh, man, oh, man, that 21 nothing was a big hole they just couldn't overcome. And then, Coach Allman, I know we already mentioned the receivers, but do you want to add in anything about them? Well, I think they did a really good job. Um, we had a great start, and then we kind of turned to the run game. Um, a little bit because we have great success with that. So I think our guys just got to get better at blocking and helping each other out throughout the game. All righty. So Central Crossing, they bring in a ton of speed. I was talking with Schoonover and Howard. Um, 
kind of tell me with, I know they have some speed, but each opponent is another opponent, as Coach Waits has mentioned to me a couple times already. So, what do you look from them? I know it's just another opponent on the schedule. Um, just what what are you looking for in your eyes? Well, they're 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 coached really well. They have good, great coaches over there. You know, Ben Needham, their defense coordinator, does a great job. Has done a great job with them for years and years and years. He was coach over here with us for years, and Ben's a great coach. Does a great job defensively, and they do. They got some they got some speed on their team. They got some athletes over there. So we'll have to be prepared for that. Um, Coach Parks. You know, same thing defensively. Um, like I said before, any team you play in the OCC, they have athletes that are all well coached. Uh, same goes with these guys. Uh, they have athletes, and you know, we just need to do a good job of getting lined up, knowing what we're doing, and tackling. Coach Allman? Yeah, we feel like we'll take our guys over anybody. There's some guys that might be a little bit faster on other teams we play, but we'll take our guys every single day. Absolutely. Uh, well, guys, um, I know things can get pretty brief here. I was look, I was wanting to make this brief. Um, any last words that you guys wanted to add before Friday's game? Well, we just appreciate you covering us, Fuzz. You're Absolutely, the man. Yeah. Go dogs. Go dogs, guys. Thanks, All right. Thanks, Fuzz. Thanks, yeah. Fuzz. It's great.